We're here at H-E-L-N-L Stadium in Gehenna, Texas. Former GM and coach Scary Pones wants his newly completed art installation to get the crowd pumped. But most are just wondering why a bunch of naked painted orcs are gyrating in the lobby. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's going to have it all. The Cleveland Burns take on the Malice Hellboys. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> and MFL Game Day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow and my partner Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. Heard you got a little touch of the mutant bird and pink flu. How are you feeling, partner? Well, uh, the projectile vomiting finally let up, but uh, the monsoon mudslides have begun. <laughs> if you know what I mean. I've been, oh. I've been literally crapping his brains out all night. He's getting stupider by the hour, if that's even possible. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. Second down and ain't going to happen, partner. Nicely done, picks up three on that pass play. Ooh la la. Third down and long. The defender's one feet just kicked in. He's so fast, he can run it. And the cornerback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. Oh, I love this dirty trick. C5 foul fumble. You gotta protect the ball better than that. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. It's a touchdown. Listen to his fans howl. They love him. He came up with a teenage werewolf in the mutant farm league. I don't know if he's dancing or just marking his territory. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return. Oh, man, that worm just ate the player alive. You got to steer clear of the pits. You know, my sister had a tapeworm almost that big. Name was pregnant. I didn't know that they made great house pets. He just got to sleep in leather underpants. The little bug is like the burrow. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there.
Second down and two. And a hard run there picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. First and ten. Now the QB is dinking and dunking the defense to sleep. <laughs> One yard on that pass. Second down and nine. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And that'll bring up third down and inches. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from top. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And he's running like a moose right now. And it's first and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. And he catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. Second down and more than the QB would like. Third down and seven. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and two. He hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Defense gives up five yards on that pass play. Second down and five. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. point attempt. <laughs> Shh, 
straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. This guy. Well, he should be more careful when he hurdles. And it's first and ten. And he breaks away. And he held on to that one for a first down. for a four-yard gain. Second down and six. One game, one game. What are you trying to do? You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. That pass play was good for three yards. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm, that's bleak, Bricks. Wow, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. He turned into a mutant fireball with that flame on dirty trick. And anything he touches gets bombay. game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. You gotta keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. First down and nine. Second down and long. The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. Yeah, they're still edible, though. Just got to scrape off the charred parts. 
third and two. left in the half. And it looks like the offense is desperate for a first down. Oh, man, what a... And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Ah, yes. You can tell this one must have just ended and burst forth from the chest of a wonderful chorus dancer. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. He's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down in a very lot. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Touchdown! Am I the only one here who has the sudden urge to eat lobster? <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but... This guy could blow it. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry-up. Yeah, same as Prince's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I thought it was a cover. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off-season. And a timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. This is going to be a long kick. Let's see if he can make it. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and, uh, or bloodthirst. Oh, man. 
You know, they train those things to eat only visiting players, but when they're hungry, they'll eat anything. Yeah, sometimes I eat my toenails. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show. Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they can start cheating and killing. That's what I do. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Up of about three on that play. Second down and seven. He was right in between being digested, that is. He's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it.
Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. First down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. Fighting for every yard. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. And this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about ten on that play. Hey, he makes up a name for himself every night. That's how he stays ahead of the bounty hunters. He's wanted in 50 states. I like this. They're going for two. And they run it in for two points. Turn here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It, it means he can return it for you. You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Second down and ten. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. Done. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty. And then he jars the ball loose, and it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle and take a hard. Well, that's the end of his day. Looks like he had a bad case of the worms. rumbling and stumbling he could go all the way and this werewolf is from london i believe signed in the off season yeah i saw him at trader Dick's hotel bar the other night his hair was perfect better watch out he'll rip your lungs out bricks <laughs> Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, man. You know, they train those things to eat only visiting players, but when they're hungry, they'll eat anything. Yeah, sometimes I eat my toenails. The third quarter 
mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. I got the thing stuck in my ear again! And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. And he punched his way out of that tackle. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Catch for a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Five-yard gain on that fast play. Hey, look at the coach. He's picking his nose. You know, they shouldn't put that on the Jumbotron. Seems like every time the camera shows him, he's either spitting, picking. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. pick up there normally a first down but here he's just making up ground yeah like the way the commission makes up news second down and in inches touchdown oh he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey actually he does have some turkey skin grafted on his backside from that bad burn he had last year oh, It should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the feet. Oh, that's got to hurt. Snatched in midair by the worm. They say that the early one gets the mutant, and he got all of him. Oh, look, he's spitting the plates out. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a rocket. He creates a sonic blast. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Second down and ten. And that is caught for a first down. First down and seven. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and six. He's not just burning down the house, he's taking it to the house. And he runs it in for the touchdown.
Yeah, I'm trying to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? That kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. You can't keep a good mutant down. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stopping time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. down in five. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that. too fast. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kicker's going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. Oh, that worm grabbed him by the head and didn't let go. If the worms go to the bathroom, Grim, or do they just crap out, you think? You're just talking a lot of crap right now. And it's first and ten. A couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. And the two minute warning sounds, they'll have to regroup during this timeout. And that'll be second and eight to go. They are, but sometimes the defense thinks they're helping out in their own special way. Third and four. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. The defense has to make something happen here with one timeout left. First and two. defense burns its last time out. You can't take them into the locker room, so you might as well use them now. Why would you want to take a time out into the locker room, Grim? That doesn't sound right. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. 
When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Briggs? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Yeah, sounds like he didn't really think. Good thing they didn't have drug testing in the MFS. The ball razors on the defense, cutting into Fender and Ham. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Briggs. This is going to get ugly fast. With a burst of speed, he finds an opening and the first down. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. The Hellboys are defeated today. They've got 99 problems, but a win ain't one of them. That's right, Grim. Just like a bridge over troubled water. Like a whole lot of Rosie. The game's most valuable player is speaking about the victory now. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.